Medeniyetler xaricdən gələn təsirlərlə zənginləşir. Cultures enrich with external impacts. There is no such poor culture in the planet. Name of this culture is migration. Participants of migration process are carers of this culture. Persons who are called migrants live migrant life by choosing outside of their homeland and try to adapt to lifestyle of that country. Rights of migrants who choose our country are protected by state migration service of Azerbaijan Republic. <laughs> Adoption date of UN Convention on Protection of Rights of All Migrant Workers and Their Family Members, which was ratified on December 18, 1990 by General Assembly, was announced International Migrants Day by the respective authority. Since then, December 18 is celebrated as International Migrants Day. This convention was ratified with December 11, 1998, date of Milli Majlis of Azerbaijan Republic. Unfortunately, I didn't have the chance to, uh, to speak to any migrants in Azerbaijan, so maybe there will be a, a, a moment that I have this opportunity. But uh, I can imagine, because of the economic growth of Azerbaijan, that most of the people coming to Azerbaijan are uh, here for, for economic reasons and to, uh, to work. Unfortunately, I only saw a little bit of Baku. Uh, uh, I, I really love the old city because it's really very beautiful. Migration service to have this uh, uh, moment to, uh, to, to, to celebrate and to think about uh, uh, migrants in, uh, in, in Azerbaijan. The 132 member states that participated in the General Assembly's high-level dialogue on international migration and development on 14-15 September 2006 reaffirmed a number of key messages. International migration is a growing phenomenon that could make a positive contribution to development in countries of origin and countries of destination if it was supported by right policies. Fundamental rights and freedoms of migrants should be respected in order to reap the benefits of international migration. Strengthening cooperation in international migration bilaterally, regionally and globally is one of the vital factors. Generally, migration dynamics in Azerbaijan Republic grows rapidly, regarding both arrivals and departures. Sure, if people didn't encounter hope and goodwill here, and traditional hospitality of Azerbaijan Republic, Azerbaijan nation, wasn't demonstrated, nobody would come. In my opinion, socio-economic development, as well as stability in the country, more mankind approach to foreigners, hospitality, non-discrimination are factors which people consider when they come to Azerbaijan. On the occasion of December 18, I congratulate all migrants, migrants in Azerbaijan and in the world, also Azerbaijani migrants living abroad, their family members and friends. Benim adım Ercan'dır, Ercan Özdemir familiyam, Ağrı Doğu Bəyazıdıyım. My name is Ercan, surname is Özdemir. I am from Ağrı Doğu Bəyazıd, but I had lived in Istanbul. I have been living in Azerbaijan for six years. Thank God, I am very happy. Let God make everyone happy. Here is harvest of our marriage. Her name is Fatosh. Negative side of being foreigner is that you are illegal migrant if your documents are not correct. But if your documents are correct, you are in a lot more good position. You can move freely everywhere. As an example, like an Azerbaijani citizen, I enjoy all the rights and live in comfort and prosperity in here because all my documents are correct. I love Azerbaijan so much. I don't feel like foreigner in here. I speak in my language. I can explain what I want to the person in front of me. It doesn't matter where I are from, what matters is the happiness. We are happy, we are satisfied with the work of service. When we go there, they serve us the way they should. Let God bless them. Foreigners coming to our country were obliged to apply to separate authorities and this registration procedure was carried out by several entities. Now regarding all these issues, they only apply to single address, State Migration Service of the Republic of Azerbaijan.
Today's State Immigration Service deals with issues related to extension of temporary staying period of foreigners, granting temporary and permanent residence permits, refugee status to foreigners seeking asylum, work permit to those who want to carry out paid labor activity, registers foreigners and stateless persons who obtained relevant permits upon place of residence, participates in the solution of citizenship issues. Foreigners and stateless persons can leave and return to Azerbaijan Republic with valid identity documents and relevant permission cards given by State Migration Service of Azerbaijan Republic. My name is Rahid Kuzar. I am from Jordan. This is my wife, Nidara. I have four children. All of them was born in Azerbaijan. They know Azerbaijani language better than me. It has been 20 years now I am in Azerbaijan. This place is my second homeland. It's calm and stable country. Development is on high level. God bless great leader Haidar Aliyev and give his worthy follower Ilham Aliyev long life. I wish the development of Azerbaijan will be eternal and we will live in peace in this country. I am Yeromin Alexander. I am the head of representation of a Russian international trade bank in Azerbaijan. Last time, I applied in November to migration service. Service works accurate in documentation process. Although rules are strict, service doesn't leave any chance for inaccuracy in this sphere. I was registered at defined time and had no problem. Comparing with 2004 and 2005, we can see that Azerbaijan have developed more. There is like two different countries. Today, Azerbaijan grows. Your constructions are grandiose. Infrastructure is improved. This development is evident. Azerbaijan differs with its stability and dynamic role not only among post-Soviet countries but also among European countries. I've got my permission card. We extended my labor activity one more year and I continue to work in Azerbaijan. Economic growth, stable conditions in our country causes tourist foreigners to make decisions on staying here. Once more, this proves that Azerbaijan grows day by day, its reputation increases in international arena and position strengthens socio-political stability rules in the country. It has been 12 years that International Migrants Day is being celebrated and its importance increased as years pass. Globalization broadening differences in local and international living standards leads to increase in external migration. At present time, more people live in other country than his or her country of origin. Behind this, vast numbers stand skilled computer engineer, farmer working illegally, woman unwillingly exposed to trafficking, refugee obliged to leave his or her home, and many other human destinies. Although these situations are different, migrants are not a heavy bulk at all when considering them as a group and this kind of approach is unacceptable. In most cases, desire for better life makes these people migrate. They search more secure and better life for their children and they are ready to work for it. Besides supporting their families and communities left behind and helping national economy with remittance millions of migrants also provide economy and society of the country they live with necessary services. Several important protection measures are considered in International Convention on Protection of All Migrant Workers and members of their families, but this document has not been ratified by all the countries. In the traditional message of UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon, it said, I urge all member states who have not yet ratified or acceded to the Convention to do so for the purpose of providing full and effective protection of migrants' rights. In 2004, state migration policy concept of Azerbaijan Republic was adopted. In this concept, tasks set in front of state authorities in the sphere of regulating migration process are defined. In order to realize issues stipulated in state migration policy concept on July 25, 2006, with the order of Ilham Aliyev, President of Azerbaijan Republic, state migration 
Education Program of the Republic of Azerbaijan for 2006-2008 was approved. Main purpose of the program is to implement state policy in the sphere of migration, to improve migration management system, to regulate and forecast migration process, to improve legislation in this sphere according to international standards and requirements of contemporary age, to provide effective application of law, to establish unified database and modern automated control system in migration sphere, to prevent illegal migration, to realize social protection measures regarding migrants, analysis, forecasts and conduction of monitoring of migration process, establishment of unified migration information system, development of international cooperation in the migration sphere, granting permissions for temporary and permanent residence to foreigners and stateless persons, etc., are included in the activities of State Migration Service. Last year, UNHCR was hosting a big ministerial conference in Geneva to celebrate our 60th anniversary for the 1951 Refugee Convention and also for the Statelessness Convention. So, overall, we are working both locally here in Azerbaijan with the State Migration Service and through State Migration Service externally in internationally to, to make the necessary uh, uh, and to bring the necessary attention to this problem globally. This year, uh, in the in, uh, beginning of October, we had our uh, executive committee and uh, which was very well uh, attended by Azerbaijan's delegation, which also included the, the head of the State Migration Service, Mr. Nabiev, so that he uh, could see how UNHCR is working. And I'm very pleased that the State Migration Service is taking the cooperation with UNHCR, not only seriously, but also uh, a very uh, involved in the day-to-day -day cooperation of our joint activities. So in, in all, if I'm going to summarize the, the cooperation with two, two, three words, it is that UNHCR and, uh, and the State Migration Service are cooperating on a very, very exceptional and uh, professional and uh, constructive and, and uh, excellent uh, manner. kardeş ülkenin ekonomisinin bu kadar geliştiği bir ortam içerisinde karşılıklı ekonomik faaliyetlerimiz de artıyor ve While economy of both brother countries grows, their mutual economic development increases more and it will increase furthermore. This is cause for flow of workers from Azerbaijan to Turkey as well as from Turkey to Azerbaijan. From this aspect, measures taken by State Migration Service as well as activity of single window system related with granting work permits, temporary staying and resident permit to citizens of Turkey Republic and generally all foreigners coming to Azerbaijan is perfect. This is very important both for Turkey and for Azerbaijan. It's important to use increasing potential of Azerbaijan in international arena. Although it's difficult, we know that with the leadership of Fredun Nabiev and its skilled employees, State Migration Service advances in the right path. I am Sirius Gochkani. I am head doctor of Khatai Clinic. I am Iranian citizen. I have been working in Azerbaijan for five years. This is my identity card. This is my work permit. We are thankful that they granted this permit to enable us work here. I don't feel like migrant. I feel like a local person here. I have been in different countries, but this is the only country which I feel native and feel like citizen. It has been five years since we came here and we try not to dissatisfy anyone. Please all our patients. On the occasion of December 18th, International Migrants Day, I congratulate all migrants and I wish they never feel themselves as a stranger and migrant. So what can I say about the relations with the Netherlands? I think that since the beginning of the uh, 
the, since the establishment of the State Migration Service five years ago, uh, there was a very close cooperation from the beginning. And the Netherlands organization, sister organization, and SMS, they uh, know each other well, they visited each other, there were study visits, there were visits on the highest level, and uh, we have come to, to a very close partnership between the two organizations. Azerbaijan, as I said, is, it's a young country, it's a country with a, an, an, a huge dynamic, uh, with a lot of challenges, uh, but also with a lot of potential for the future. And uh, I think it's very interesting for me as a diplomat, as an ambassador, to be in Azerbaijan at this juncture of time and to be part of these developments and trying to make a contribution from the Netherlands to this development. And I think the country uh, with its beauty and its hospitality is a pleasure to live in and for me and my family and I want to thank the Azerbaijanis uh, for uh, the way they receive us here and uh, help us uh, make our life and make our work easier. Being the representative of the government of Pakistan has always tried to have very good and friendly relations with the local department and sections of the State Migration Service in Baku. I have personally met with the Chief of uh, the uh, migration, uh, State Migration Service, General Fariuddin Nebayov, Head of the Migration Service, and we have discussed all the problems which Pakistani communities facing are which at that time were in, in our record. Since my arrival in Azerbaijan one and a half year ago, I have been witnessing rapid process of development, economic development in Baku, and Baku is becoming a hub of activities, including the economic activities in the region. And I'm sure that uh, you will agree that uh, it is one of the beautiful countries in the region. The people of Azerbaijan are very friendly, and they cherish special love, love for Pakistan, as we know that Pakistan and Azerbaijan are enjoying the highest level of political relations between the two countries. And we congratulate the, the people of Azerbaijan, the government of Azerbaijan, that they, they, they have got such a leadership like uh, President Elam Aliyev, whose vision has given them a very good chance, who, they, who is spending a lot on the development of the common people in Azerbaijan. And uh, I, I, I may add here that uh, this vision, the, the, the vision of the pres present president, he has inherited this vision from his late father, the father of the nation of Azerbaijan, Haider Aliyev. The State Migration Service extends its bilateral relations with Germany, Netherlands, Belgium and other countries. Thus, steps are being taken towards deepening mutual relations with CIS and Asian countries. For operatively informing foreigners and stateless persons, Migration Information Center operates in three languages. Migration Information Center. When intended to get detailed information, foreigners and stateless persons can call 919 Hotline of Migration Information Center. 919 is always at your service. Reception process of documents of foreigners and stateless persons applying to service is being organized by considering electron shift principle. At the same time, reception of documents of 14 persons and granting of relevant permission cards is assumed. My name is Tolga Kavun. I am Turkish citizen. I don't feel like a stranger since the day of my arrival. People are very friendly and pleasant. Your country is really beautiful. It's more beautiful city than I know. You have a modern city. Its people are really warm and good. I'm really happy to be here. I was not only in Baku. I also visited your regions, Kazakh and Balkan. Very beautiful. I don't feel like a migrant because I feel like I am at my own home, own country and own land. We are two states, one nation. I can Congratulate all migrants in Azerbaijan.
Questions related with rules on stay, residence, work and registration in the country are being answered operatively via question answer section or webpage of State Migration Service. The webpage is www.migration.gov.us. It is an obvious example of ensuring foreigners' comfort and special concern to them that there are detention centers at Kurdakani and Yevlak. Caring of migrants is on a high level here. Most people have little information about these detention centers, but it should be specially noted that it seems like a resort more than detention center. Thus, consider comfort of foreigners that are living rooms, sport ground, as well as a park to walk in the yard of the center. Greenies and fountain in the yard of center are particularly beautiful. There are special child rooms for little migrant children. On arrival here, the Azerbaijan bakery is very good and very nice. But when we are there in our employer, it was then that we feel that Azerbaijan is not that really good that we are expecting. But uh, at this time, presently, that uh, somebody helped us to go back to our home. And in uh, overall. We have seen that really Azerbaijan is a blessed country and uh, Azerbaijan is a develop, developing country and uh, very nice. The service that the state migration that give, given up to us here is 101% perfect. <laughs> they are so kind, all of them. They serve us. We are not expecting that the service of state migration, this is our first time based to other country that we have been there before this is the first time that i am and we are me and my husband so proud with this state migration the way they treat us the way they treat people the way they serve they they really have the compassion <laughs> <laughs> okay <laughs> The exhibition prepared by employee of the State Migration Service, Ainur Rustamova, was a gift for migrants on Migrants' Day. Migrants' rights are highly protected by State Migration Service. If they are illegal, their work is legalized. In cases where it cannot be legalized, measures are implemented at the state level by protecting their rights. I congratulate migrants on International Migrants' Day on behalf of Minister of Internal Affairs. State Migration Service protects rights of foreigners in our country, fights against illegal migration, and urges foreigners to comply with our laws. This means protection of our country, to protect by means of our laws and words that our laws are based on. Our country is our soul, and the borders of this country are our body. And for this reason, children of this country are inclined to exaggerate the smallest misunderstanding against country borders to aggression against our country. The borders of the country must also be sacred for the person crossing border and deciding to live in another country. Mm -hmm. 